Hey everyone, it's Ashley, your independent Sensi consultant. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, apologies for this like somewhat abrupt video. My whiff box just came in and it actually was on the porch for like three hours. So hopefully these things are like in fine condition. Um, but I've seen spoilers like 15 days ago. I've been waiting so long for this package. I ordered it with my business supplies and looking back, I probably should have put it in my Scentsy Club. That process is on the fourth because I had got that already and this I was waiting for. So I think I'm gonna do that going forward. Um, let's dive right into it. I'm really excited based on some of the sneaks I've seen. I don't entirely remember everything, but I think the little cups are back for the sample of the set of the month, so I'm really excited. I wanna put this up here, but I feel like it's gonna jiggle the camera, so I apologize. Okay. Um, it's a celebration in pink and uh, it says July 30th is International Friendship Day. There's no better, better way to celebrate with your friends than a sweet scentsy gift. Use these cards to give the gift of fragrance to all your besties. I was wondering why everything was pink in here, but it just says like I'm tickled pink, you're my friend and there's all these little notes. I was wondering about that. Pink is the sweet caring friend you'll know you'll always be there. Okay, let's get into it. I'm excited. Okay, this is the only thing like just right on top, right out in front. It's Cloudberry Dream Washer Whiffs. And you guys, I don't really like Cloudberry Dream, but in the Washer Whiffs, they're really, really good. Like they're very strong and they're a lot better in the Washer Whiff. Um, they have like a very distinct rose note, which is not cool with me in the wax, <laughs> but in the Washer Whiffs, they're really good. Okay. Oh, we got some things that are hiding underneath. We have a pink sugarberry mint car bar. I can get down with that. And then we also have a pink sugarberry mint room spray, which I do have one of these already for my scent of the month kit, but I do like this scent. And I do, I'm interested to try it in the car bar because I feel like in the wax and the room spray, they're a little bit different from each other. And then we just have this very tiny amount of like that little shreddy stuff because I'm sorry to do this, but I have to open this and it's gonna be loud. Oh, I thought maybe we found a opening. Nope, it's pretty loud. Ice pack, I've been really accumulating these here recently. Okay, I don't, were these the bars I saw a sneak peek? I'm not entirely positive. Okay, I like these little bags, but like, I don't know. In theory, I'm like, I would love to reuse them to ship out people's wax, but I don't know. They're so big, <laughs> so whatever. Okay, the cup is back, I'm really excited. So we have two pink scents, however, One's like technically green. We have pink rhubarb sugar and prickly pear and agave. So pink rhubarb sugar is honestly not my favorite. I need a mix. It's so sickeningly sweet that like, what could I mix it with? I wonder if I could honestly mix it with this prickly pear and agave. I like this. It's very, very fresh. And I'm glad I have another bar because I just used up my last one. And I don't really want to put it in my club. Like, it's nice, but I don't necessarily want to put it in my club. These might be really nice mixed together. Like, the sweetness, but, the, like, this is super fresh and not tart, but, like, it's not sweet whatsoever. I feel like these would actually mix together really, really well. Ooh. Okay, I like that. I, I really had no idea what to mix with this because I feel like... Have we gotten this in a whiff box already this year? Like, I feel like they're really pushing us onto the pink rhubarb sugar and I'm just not a fan, but I feel like I'm the minority. I feel like people really like that one and I personally just don't. Okay, I really am just mostly excited to smell this little cup, but let's just kind of recap. So I think these are $12. I think the room spray is $8, I think. So that's, $20 right there. And then this is 12 and then this is six. So that's 18 more dollars. So we're at $38. Is that right for quick math? 
it seems right okay <laughs> the scent of the month for august is glacier water and it's blue which and i feel like it's a very interesting concept for a scent of the month for august because i feel like i'm pretty sure i saw patricia gates talk about this that she felt like it was mostly lavender based okay it's kind of it's sweaty so i don't really want to touch it it's been like a good six months since we've had these little sample cups so this gives me hope i don't have the notes on me but i don't feel like it's all lavender I, it's very fresh it kind of kind of reminds me of like a body care it's like reminiscent of something but i can't put my finger on what it is <laughs> okay i don't ah, no not my chair <laughs> it's so wet <laughs> okay i'm gonna need to wipe that up um this smells like some kind of body care I don't feel like I'm getting a specific note from it. It's kind of like fresh and green. But I know there's definitely lavender in the scent notes, but I don't feel like I'm getting lavender, to be honest. I'm probably going to melt this right away because it's already open. But it kind of reminds me of like arctic kiss eskimo not eskimo kiss uh polar bear hug like those scents that are a bunch of things put together that you wouldn't typically put together and they smell extremely unique but also i don't want to touch it like i feel like if i'd warm it up it maybe give me something different but it's so juicy i don't really want to touch it it's i was expecting based on Patricia's sole comment that it smelled like lavender, I was expecting it to be like deeper kind of, but it's actually very like refreshing. It's in the fresh category. I should have my bars um, in actually a few days. Like that's how long it's taken this to get here is the, um, my scent of the month kit has already shipped and is already arriving soon. And this just arrived, but I am going to melt this regardless because I, I need the scent of the month kit either way if I get this or not. It's totally not what I was expecting. Like it's very fresh, which I feel like is decent for this time of year. Initially when I saw lavender, I was like, what an odd time. Like I feel like maybe the scent notes are described as a more like February scent, but I could see how it could maybe be fall, winter, maybe more winter. But we'll we'll see. We'll melt. We'll give it a melt and we'll see. So um, I am excited that I finally got this with box. I do feel like the last few with boxes have been a little bit better, more of my alley, I guess. However, some of these things are fine. Maybe they're just like not my preferences. I do like the pink theme. I think that is very fun. Um, but regardless, if the cups are back, like I'm super happy. I've been getting the whiff boxes, even though the cups haven't been available because I like to share them with you guys. Um, like if nobody bought the whiff box, how would we know spoilers of what's in the whiff box? <laughs> so I like to share them and I repurpose the products. If I like, don't like them, I will, you know, give them away as a freebie or whatever so it's fine but I completely can see why customers would want to watch a person's review before like buying in case they didn't like more than half of these products or something along the lines of that but you guys the scent cups are back not saying it's worth $30 for a scent cup for a t for a sneak peek of the scent of the month but I know they carry a lot of weight in the sense community. So let me know what you guys have, um, what you think if you got this with box. I have a ton of with box videos to watch like people's reviews on because I've just been waiting to get mine. Um, and then I also got some other things in this package that I'm super excited to share. Those videos will be coming up later this week. So thank you guys so much for watching and hanging out with me. I'll see you uh, later this week. <laughs> Bye.